Okay guys, I'm back in Garena Speed Drifters. So in this video, I'm gonna explain about the Star Source Core, this one, the Polaris ECU. So most of you already know that this is the ECU we've been waiting for. Which yeah. Anyway, yeah. Back to uh, we are in this Polaris ECU now. We have the Bling ECU. We we want wanting to wait for this ECU to come to speed lifters and finally here it is but there are some problems eh, with the uh, ECU there's some bug that's going on that uh, some people might even get banned just by using this ECU so if you see uh, there's some there's some videos that saying that you will get the ban if you use the ECU before the finish line eh? um, if you use the ECU for going to the next lap or finishing the race so yeah the system detects uh, your gameplay like as if you are using a, a hack or something eh? like like using some kind of plug-in that uh, alters your speed that's the problem eh? um, if you use this ECU when you want to cross the finish line uh, the system will misjudge you uh, thinking that you are using a hack so there's a risk right now until they fix this bug, uh, I don't know when will they fix it. Uh, we mustn't use this ECU before you enter the next lap or finishing the race. So don't use it at the end of the lap. But that's the thing, this is not 100% uh, confirmed that's causing it to ban. Because this is uh, from what other people got banned, from the reason they got banned. Okay? Mostly the ones they got banned because they did this. They use the ECU before the finish line so that's it lah alright that's the risk that we so far we know but there are some cases like uh, I saw Tafi's uh, video he didn't use it before the finish line he just run a uh, normal run as you can see uh, this is uh, what the Chinatown he used the ECU somewhere else not even at the finish line but his account got banned so there is some risk eh? we don't not sure what is actually making it uh, trigger this uh, ban? Okay, thought we we thought it was the finish line problem, but maybe there's another reason that that can cause players to get banned. So it could be uh, maybe breaking a new record, eh? maybe because Chinatown. Not many people play Chinatown, so yeah, just uh, be careful lah of using this ECU. If you don't want to take the risk, I suggest take the bottom ECU okay the star explosion one and this one is item eh? so yeah uh, if you don't want to if you don't want to get risk uh, of getting banned it's not it's not supposed to be getting banned it's just a bug eh? because the system detection of players hacking is uh, if they cross the finish line too fast then uh, they detect you as playing hack that's the that's the that's how they detect uh, auto auto hack lah, all right so there are some hackers who are smart, they slow down at the finish line and they don't get banned. But because this system uh, method of uh, detecting hack is still the same, they even detect ECU as a hack. So that's why you may get banned. Alright, so anyway, uh, that's my explanation on this uh, ECU problem, uh, ECU bug problem. If you don't want to take the risk of getting banned, you stay at the bottom ECU. Alright? But if you think you are you are alright, you don't uh, use ECU. There are two reasons, eh? not just uh, ECU for for finishing the race, but also if you use ECU for doing some bug eh? bug shortcut like music uh, music factory, for example. And also there's also another bug shortcut you can do like Nightless Sensitivity and also Nuschwanstein. But the bug shortcuts are not confirmed eh? if you get banned for using it for bug shortcut that one I don't, don't know if it's uh, actually the re uh, reason maybe you can do the bug shortcut but uh, you won't get banned so, uh, but just to be safe better don't better don't use it for bug shortcut or whatever alright that's uh, my explanation on the what's going on with this band thing eh? so uh, I'm going to it's already f 5 minutes of me explaining about the band thing but now I'm going to show you the the bling ECU normally all right basically if you activate the ECU uh, the first three branch okay not yet not yet picking side yet 
uh, you have nitro top speed plus 0.4 and end tank uh, fill up plus 0.2 uh, charge, uh, charge time 0.2 and also then the start source uh, when you collect the ECU charges then you got basic power plus 0.8 when you pick the left side you get crash weight plus 60 so you can actually uh, this one include increases uh, collision weight eh? so you can even use this ECU to uh, collide people eh? like, like Renault <laughs> so this ECU is not uh, to break record but for battle eh? it's actually a battle this is to break the record usually we pick the break record and not the battle but this is the first battle ECU that everyone's using now so the skill is actually after using it the car will immediately spring forward go to the front and uh, if you successfully overtake an opponent you get a mini boost and maximum speed of the mini boost plus 4 km per hour within 3 seconds so this one I didn't know I thought it just boost you into the front but when I read this description if you overtake someone you get a mini boost that one I didn't know eh? <laughs> So that's why sometimes you get a mini boost extra. So it's actually recommended when you overtake someone. You use it when you don't overtake someone, so never mind. But when you overtake someone, you get a mini boost actually. Yeah? And then uh, if you add this two, uh, you get acceleration increase four second. How does that work? Acceleration effect duration increase four second. All right. And uh, mini boost acceleration effect mini boost increase by four if you max it out. Eh? So let's see um, how this ECU actually works. Eh? I'm just showing it. All right. So this ECU activates when you call when you use a nitro. There you go. So it already has one. If I nitro again, you have two. All right. That's the basic. So if you ECU, now like that. So your speed just went to 500 instantly and then slow down. Right, so you can see. Uh, if you're drifting an ECU, uh, also can, but your drifting must be uh, stopped. Lah, all right. If you're if you're drifting at halfway an ECU, that ECU won't work. Eh? Okay, I'll just play my music. Maybe like this. Ah, like that. While you're drifting like that, you won't get the boost. All right. All right. Let me just exit. So there is actually a. Uh, uh, montage of where you can use this ECU eh, for all the maps maybe I'll give a link uh, at the bottom just to show all that you can ECU and uh, maybe some of my runs also from uh, Wild West for example okay because uh, I got 106 yes uh, that last time I stream and I used the ECU at certain parts okay, for example here that's one and one here so yeah using this ECU can get you like two seconds faster new record but that's the thing eh? uh, there is some risk using it because of this uh, detection bug eh? uh, hack detection bug you can use this ECU certain places to, to go faster usually on turnings where uh, will take some time eh? like you do must do your U-turn or maybe a uh, certain shortcut yeah there are some places where this ECU very of the whole map certain areas much recommended to use there but uh, this ECU doesn't work on item mode eh? I tried playing in rank item uh, equip the ECU but there was no ECU button for item map so I'm not sure if that's a bug or is it uh, really supposed to be like that I don't remember but in uh, the latest ECU, you can. Alright, so that's the ECU for the bling. Uh, quite long already, eh? but uh, I will change this now. Um, 600 points. Alright, the safer choice. So uh, let me upgrade the bottom ECU now. Alright, so now the bottom one, this max speed plus 0 0.4. And this one, star explosion ECU. So if you activate this ECU, your base max speed plus 3 km. Uh, for 8 seconds and you get 1% end tank per second so this one just increase end tank per second uh, and also increase your base maximum speed it is also quite good you get end tank but also it's a safer choice compared to the uh, the left, left one eh, if you don't want to get banned 
for now. Alright, until they fix the problem. Uh, this one is max speed increase. Okay, I don't, I don't need to increase it's this. Uh. I'll just test this ECU eh, first. So, same thing. You nitro, only then you get your ECU. Right, so, if I, uh, let's say, I ECU now. Eh. Okay, there. And tank is slowly increasing. And just now increase plus 3 km per hour. From 309, it went 313. So now it's okay. Now it's three one zero. Wait, uh, let me do again. Three one zero. I see you. Yeah, three one three. Right. And the end tank slowly increase. All right. That's all it does. Uh. This is the safer ECU if you don't want to get banned, but it's not as effective as the bling one. All right. This ECU will be useless. Eh? I'll say no one will be using this ECU because everyone will be using the blink ECU. But because this blink ECU is still uh, having this ban bug thing, uh, just just choose this as a safe option. All right, and the last one. Time to undo this again. So the right increase mini boost power by one, and also ah uh, this is it temporal flashback. So this skill. The latest CC also got, but nobody uses it. Eh? No, everyone still using uh, prefer the Blink ECU, even though in item. But <laughs> but this one will will also be in the latest yellow ECU. Eh? So activate the temporal flashback skill uh, for five seconds after passing missile and uh, Scoobies is uh, Koopy eh? to teammates in a single game. So if you pass a missile or Koopy to teammate. This ECU you, you can use to get the item that you just passed. So it's basically a support ECU. Eh? Like if you use the. Uh, if you have a Koopy or a Missile, um, you pass to a teammate, you use this ECU, you, you get that item again. And uh, I think there's some more here. From Missile and Koopy, it can add some more. Eh? Uh, ink. One uh, Level 1, you, get, you can get Ink. I think there will be more later. Let me, let me just upgrade up ink Ink and shield Ink and shield and then acceleration effect Okay, and then here is just max speed eh? Alright, yeah So, once you upgrade up to 2 levels At least 2 for this one You pass either Koopy, Missile, Ink or Shield You use this ECU, you get the item again uh, That is the item ECU lah. I hope this ECU works eh? Because just now I said the bling ECU doesn't show in item. Let me just try. Eh? Okay. So, I didn't think quick race team item got match. Eh? So, I'm trying on a quick race team item. Uh, I couldn't find rank team item. But I want to see if the ECU works. Eh? If the ECU doesn't show up, then it's a uh, bug on item. Eh? Okay, the ECU is there, I can see it. The clock thing is there. So I need a shield. Um, what was it? Koopy, yeah. Koopy, okay, but I need to pass it. Yeah. Pass. Okay, there you go. Ah, it works, alright. So yeah, this ECU, if you pass a, some item, uh, you can press that clock to get the item again. But only once uh, because uh, for item ECU you can only use the ECU once. So I recommend to use that that ECU uh, maybe not in the early game, maybe a bit late. <laughs> maybe in the late game then you use it. Alright guys, so I think that's it for this uh, video uh, for me explaining the Polaris ECU. Eh. So there is the Blink ECU but there is a bug where you may get banned if you use it before the finish line and maybe for some bot shortcuts for the bot shortcuts i don't know not confirm and uh this is the safe ecu right now if you don't want to use the bling ecu because you might get banned uh just use the bottom one the star explosion ecu and the item ecu yeah the item ecu you can use in item mode the bling ECU doesn't work eh, in item mode, so yeah, no choice, eh, you have to take this one for the item. Okay, uh, just another warning, if you accidentally uh, use this ECU at the finish line, right away exit the game, straight away exit the game, okay, don't finish the race. If you finish the race, then 
that's when you may get banned. So if you accidentally used it uh, on the finish line, just quickly exit the game. You, are, you should be fine. And yeah, if you actually did get banned, uh, the only way I guess you have to report to the uh, Karina support uh, if you get banned. Uh, and I hope they fix this. Karina, please, uh, another bug here. So alright guys, uh, that's it for this Polaris ECU uh, explanation from me. Uh, I might still be using the Bling ECU, uh, just I have to be careful lah. <laughs> until they fix the bug, lah. until they fix this uh, detection bug. Alright guys, thank you guys for watching this video, see you guys next time.